server special here. Let's go 1911 with a silencer and armor. This guy's following me too. It's really unfortunate. Although it actually worked out in our favor. So we're going up here. This is my place in Lee. He does instant headshots with snipers. Yeah, he's a good player. He's a good player. Thanks, cheese. Thank you, cheese. I think there's a way to turn Twitch clips into shorts fairly easily, too. I need to look into doing that. I saw somebody talking about that the other day. I only got one there. Imagine if I had three knives. It's an argument for carrying more knives. Not a horrible trade, although we are... Well, I was going to say we're 2v3, but now we're 2v2. Okay. Interesting rotate here. Oh, damn. That's too bad. System Spice so playing with the AWP, huh? I've thought about playing with the AWP or the hunting rifle. It'd be a fun playstyle. It's really not that bad once you get used to it. Very good with them. Right, what's gonna happen? Or did they both have. No, he's got an AUG, okay. Damn. Look at these misses. They're just hitting the ground and stuff. More misses. I mean, this is just embarrassing for all parties here. Goodness gracious. Wow. Can you imagine this happening in an actual war zone? Surely it has. Ooh, okay. They got him ultimately. He took out his pistol to get him for some reason. Uh... Close one there. Ha, huh, that's really something. Uh, okay. Let's see here. Oop. Oh, no. Oh, I needed that knife. Oh, that makes me so sad. Ha, oh, damn. I was trying to go double knife here. Yeah, it does make me want to learn to play. I've never used the uh, the opt or the hunting rifle that much. It's not that expensive either. Hunting rifle is only sixteen hundred. Clouds are on our side now. Could go either way. Ooh, he's good with it though. Damn. Okay, he's got a plant. He's got 35 seconds. Ooh, cloud is low. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. One shot. That's all it's gonna take. Wow. Wow. Incredible. Incredible. 
All right, let's try his game here. You think there's any difference? Is there like more penetration or something? I guess you could reload it faster. That's something. <laughs> that's that's justice there that I got him with the hunting rifle. Hell yeah. <laughs> I feel like the silencer really stuffed it up. Look, he left! He left! <laughs> oh, okay, we've achieved moral victory. I mean, it doesn't even matter what happens now. <laughs> that was for you, Asmorin. That was for you. Crazy loadout here. Should I switch to the other team? I feel like they'll get back to it. Cloud was over there earlier. Maybe he'll switch back. Oh, that car, the geometry there. These poor guys. Right, let's even it out. Ain't touch me. Catch what you <laughs> so fucking funny to me. <laughs> Try, 
<laughs> I'm just trying to put it on here for him. There we go. Oh. <laughs> I tried for so long to do that. Hey Pikachu guy, you got the bomb. Can you plant it, please? Maybe the word for Pikachu is different in German. Sad. <coughs> Where's the actual guy with the bomb here? Oh, he's. Hey! Oh. The man has been abgestochen. Jesus. Deine Mutter. Dude, shake his gun like no, I do not want. <laughs> But Jack failing so hard, what are you talking about? We're winning, aren't we? Yeah, we're winning. I switched teams and we were winning. The one on the other team won it on this team. Uh, okay, so I went to the range and can't confirm I still hate sniper scopes. Yeah, they're not my first choice. Uh, watch some tutorial about keeping both eyes open. More people do it the wrong way. It's just not about keeping your aim up, also just faster. Try it. Welcome, Pixel. Good to see you, by the way. Good to see you. Uh, use both eyes for aim. Cheese. What language is that? What language is that? Suka. That's Russian, maybe? Suka Vlat, right? That's, that's like the uh, national slogan or something. I thought before it'd be really cool um, to have a uh, a live translator app in Pavlov that like give you subtitles, which I think you could actually do now with Whisper, a few other AI apps. Be pretty neat though for uh, Pavlov or other VR games where you're running into people who speak a multitude of languages. But it'd actually be really cool to just like know what these guys are saying right now. Or like whoever. Same with VR chat. Even cooler if I could respond to them too, you know. It's like all that tech exists today, you just have to wire it up. I don't think it'd even be that hard really. Alright. Babblefish. Alright, this is risky. Let's see if I can pull it off correctly here. Got 
lucky. Alright, 3v4. Looks like A. Let's get in at long A here. or something would be nice right now. Might have had better luck with both of the deagles out. Uh, it is Russian. Suka surprise. I know what Suka means, but I forgot. Now that one I don't think was Russian. I think that was German. I think there's multiple languages going on. I think. I think. Uh, let's do a smoke. Let's do an extra knife. Oh, sweet. There's one right here. Should I do three knives? Tempting. I, mean, I got another hundred bucks. Nah, I'll just do two. Two's a lot. Oh, I could have had it in my other hand. Uh, yeah, that's what I should have. Oh, is J-Bar streaming too? I watch J-Bar sometimes. He's a nice guy. Just beer and headshots. That's what that stands for. And yeah, he's got that treadmill. What's it called? It's the... I always forget the name of it. Haptax or something? No, that's something else. It's the one with the shoes. You know? You know what I'm talking about? You know what I was watching the other day is, uh, did you guys see the video that Marques Brownlee, MKBHD, did on uh, the Disney uh, VR treadmill? Really cool. The one with the, like little spinning things that you walk on. You gotta, you gotta watch this if you haven't seen it. Feels like they're really figuring something out here. Like, I think it, it's going to be an, like a really early version, and it may be one of those things that's like more available than in arcades than in houses. Maybe, you know? But just the fact that they've got it working as a proof of concept is like, okay, we've got like a really viable solution for locomotion now. Because I've, I've talked to J-Bar before about the... Uh, I've talked to J-Bar before about the, the treadmill that he has. And uh, from talking to him, and then also talk to uh, talk to uh, Genghis. If you ever talk to her, watch her content. She's got some pretty cool stuff. Um, it seems like that kind of stuff. It's like it's fun, but it doesn't really feel like walking. You know what I mean? You're doing kind of like a. You're doing like a, another. It's almost like you've got pedals. You know what I mean? You've got like another control input you can use with your feet, and it's close to walking. You know. It's better than just, you know, locomotion with a joystick, but I don't think you really feel like you're walking. Now, I have seen ones, like prototype ones. There's another video I saw, this is years ago, where they did have an omnidirectional treadmill where you actually are walking. It's just normal shoes, and you're walking, uh... And you're walking, uh in different directions and it's like tracking and changing but it looked kind of janky oh i got him here 
interesting spot. Oh, look at that beautiful flank here. He ran right through. We're gonna do a little flank of our own. Right, he goes A here, right? Don't you think? Kinda has to. He was going to be. Look at that. All right. Catwalk. The catwalk VR. That's what it's called. Oh, yeah. Pixel set right there. Very nice. Man, the free advertisement. Uh, Bojack will never just sell out. <laughs> I forgot about that. Oh, man. Oh, I died to the chat on that one. Uh, that reminds me what happened to Silent. I haven't seen you guys in a while. He's still around. He, uh, he still plays really late at night. So on the late night streams, he'll show up sometimes. But it's usually, it's gotta be really late to catch him. Like, if I'm playing at, like, 2 a.m., He'll, he'll show up. It's always nice to see him. Oh. Damn. That would have been a really good one to win, too. Okay. Alright. Let's get this together here. 50. Hello. Hello. Okay. Let's play cat. Cat's a good default spot to play. When in doubt, cat it out. <laughs> Tempt you to play this little lip right here, honestly. Not worth the trade. Three v four. Ooh, two v four. Oh my God, they got all. All right, we're gonna have to do three in a row here. Three in a row. Hop on at two a.m. Hop on to boar. I think I might hop on to boar after this. It's something pretty fun, honestly. Uh, still though, I got used to those late night poker streams and still stay up till 3 a.m. I hear you, man. I don't really stay up quite that late most times now, but, uh, it is really fun to stream late at night. There's something about late nights that's, like, it's more fun for streaming, I feel like. I don't know what that is. Jesus. That, that gets him. That gets both of them. Yeah. All right. Well, at least we did something there. Lately, I've been liking to bounce my nades, like, off of the ground to, get to like, stay kind of where I want them to go. And instead of just, like, throwing them there directly, it's a good system. Oh, the sawed off. <laughs> Threw that like a battering. Well, I think that is the game here. I think that is the game. Oh, he didn't even try. 